Yo, Curlza, what's up? Curlza, I have to admit, I, I, I can't, I didn't get my rank up. I was winning a bunch of uh, my matches, and I lost two matches, and I'm back where I started again, so... How are you, mates? I am doing good, Curls. How are you doing? All right. What do we want to do here? I, I honestly want to get my ranking back up, so I might be a little biased on what I'm picking here. Welcome to the grinds. Hey, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Good tires, your tires, oh man. Um, I didn't. Banjoki, whoa, yo, play. What happened to your? Oh, Banjoki, you didn't see anything. You didn't see a thing. I might have accidentally done some, uh, luck based settings, and I got a little triggered, and I, <laughs> I kind of went in the the opposite direction. I was doing auto setup on classic one v ones, and it, it didn't go well. Did you save that video for us to watch? Do you want me to uh, get that, Krolzo? I uh, wasn't sure if you were going to be uh, around right now. And Zachary Ghostblade with the raid. Let's go, Zachary Ghostblade. Much appreciated. How you doing, Zachary? How's your game go? I I'm sorry, Zach. I actually left your stream a little, a little while ago. I had you uh, step away and do something, but I did get to see the end of your match there. Why would you do auto setup? You know, that's a good question. Curls uh, flames me for doing auto setup too. I, I thought it was, I thought I was just bad at it because I, I was losing all the time. I kept on losing. And I thought it was just me, but uh, I guess maybe it was luck based or something. No problem. I did pull out the win that game. Nice. That's awesome. Up to you. All right, all right. Here's the Turtle Viper, so he won easily. Here's the Turtle Viper, so he won easily. Of course. Of course, Zach. Zachary won. It's easy. Um, all right, Krauza. Let me see. I don't know if I downloaded this video. We are taking a bit here. Uh, how long are you going to be here, Krauza? Because I can quickly get this. What day was that? Oh, my gosh. I don't even remember what day this was. Was this the 28th? Uh, let me see, where is Britannia? I'll definitely pull it up, Krolza, if I can find what day it is. I can be around for a while. I need to stay up for a while, then go back to sleep for a night shift. All right. And actually, I can't even stream that long either because I do have to uh, go back to work in a little bit for um, production support. So I won't be streaming long anyways. Oh, man, I'm so disappointed, Krolza. I, I wish I, I set this up in advance. I, I didn't think I, you were going to be around tonight. Boo, long stream, let's go. I know it's Friday. I would love to do a long stream today. Um, it doesn't look like it was the day I played zombies. All right, our lobby still isn't full here. Was it the 28th?
Oh man, I've not seen this in my VODs, Kralza. Did I already doubt? Oh, we got a full lobby. It's okay, we could do it another day if wanted. Alright, no, I'll I'll keep looking for a Kralza. I, I'm I think I actually downloaded it. Oh okay, this isn't it. See you later guys, it's past 3 a.m. for me, so I need to get some sleep. Gonna stream a game tomorrow though. Hey, that's awesome, Gandalis. Thank you for stopping by. Oh wow, we go first. I haven't even looked at the board yet. We go first. Don't play next to bubblegum or blue. Orange, red. Uh, what if we go for this? I don't play next to blue, but I'm playing next to blue. All right, let's see how this backfires on us. Night, Gandolias. Good night, man. Good night. Oh, okay. I'm going to have a quick look at these other VODs real quick. This wasn't yesterday. This had to have been the weekend. Oh, is it a day I played uh, seven days? Oh, there's no way I played seven days. It was likely the weekend. Oh, okay, okay. Then let me see. Oh, yeah, I just found a VOD on the weekend. Oh, but it's not showing me the... Oh. Ah, okay, I found it, Krulza. Rating and power level, and what day is it? Oh my gosh, I don't even know what day I'm looking at. Is this the 26th? I think it's the 26th. Okay, yeah, yeah. Alright, let me download this, Krulza. And then uh, I'll set this up while this game is going. Alright, I actually haven't been paying attention at all to this game because I do want to set this up. All right, where are we? We are yellow. Um, everyone has gone except for blue, pink. No one's attacked us. We still have our position in here. I think red attacked in Australia. I don't recall this many red pieces. Um, orange looks like he attacked up here, trying to take over this top region. Royal might have attacked down here, but I think Royal also lost some pieces to people because he's down to 13. I think Royal's been getting attacked by these other these other guys up here. Blue's offline. Blue's a bot. Nice. And Blue's not going to interfere with us. Oh, Royal's off. What? Oh, we're playing two bots. All right. Uh, these two guys are bots. Pink is still in the game. Oh, Pink's going to fight a bot out of here wants this wow all right then we might actually get away with this africa uh this bottom portion of africa should i say my joke um go for it crawls let's say your joke now there's three bots in the game now oh gosh you're a comedian crawls now that's <laughs> have to lobby your bots <laughs> Real funny. <laughs> you know, after my ranking drops so much, I guess I am a bot. Only a bot would manage to lose his ranking. Alright, 
I'm not gonna blitz a five on three because uh, I'm probably not gonna get up. No one else has any other pressure, so there's no need for us to um, take this uh, so early. <laughs> nice, Krulza. Your play loves it. Oh, okay. <laughs> You know, that might give me another idea for, like, another alt account, like, um, you'll play bot account or something. That would be cool if, um, Risk, uh, added bots after humans like they do in chess. You know how they have chess players, uh, chess bots? after real players, what if they made uh, risk uh, AI bots after real players? Maybe I'll rename my alt that yo plays bots. <laughs> yo plays bot, yo plays bot, plays better than me. Oh wow, Red's gonna get that? Oh wow, he barely got that too, I don't like that. We're at 14, we get 4 troops at the moment. I need 2 troops to take a 7, 100%. Uh, the real question is, is Red gonna break me if I do this? Does Red break me? And if Red is gonna break me, should I defend in a way that makes me uh, retaliate? Like, if I keep my 5-stack where it is, I attack this 3-stack, but I pull it back here to fight Red if he wants to break me, and I'll straw this right here. Yo, plays bot. Oh. <laughs> Orange taking this, though. Everyone took uh, a region, except for uh, Pink. And the bot. Okay, then I guess all the human players have a, a region except for blue, and all the bots don't have one. <laughs> Man, being a bot's so tough. Did you see my guy got top 100 yesterday? I did, Krulza. I was up this morning. Um, I was uh, in the stream. I did see him get it. Big Bad Riz, yeah, he got up to 98. He played uh, two 1v1s or something and got uh, up two ranking points. Wow, watch him get this two on one here. Oh, he doesn't get a three on one. Thank goodness. I am so glad Bubblegum doesn't get that because I didn't want pressure from Bubblegum, truthfully. Um, and I really want to see Red break me. I will destroy him. It's not bubblegum, they changed it back to pink, the name. Oh, did they? They don't actually call it bubblegum? Oh, well, they used to say the color right here. Oh, they do, it's red. Okay, that's not the color though. Is anyone, oh, you're right, that did say red. This is blue, so this isn't uh, oceanic. I, I don't remember what that used to be called. This is yellow. Yeah, they used to be pineapple. All right, I guess we could call it the actual color. So why did they get rid of that naming? Oh, it's in the notes. Oh, okay. Or the patch. Gotcha. Alright, he just broke me. I mean, he didn't just break me. He attacked my one stack. Yeah, Red used to say Scarlet. Yes. You oh, you're right. It did say Scarlet. Alright, then we'll just call him by the... I dare Orange to break me. There's no way. I actually don't dare Orange. I hope Orange doesn't break me, because I don't... <laughs> unlock your 8, please, yo, play. Hey, right there, Orange unlocked it for me. Orange unlocked it for me. Well, it's unlocked now. 
Rosa, it's only like turn three, four here. I, my eight stack being blocked in doesn't matter. It was more of a defense mechanism than it was for an attacking. We're we're not even thinking about eliminating players. There's no there's no uh, advantage to be it unblocked. All right. You should always uh, think about eliminating players. All right, even on turn one. Even turn one, we'll think about eliminating players. I gotcha. It should be in your, <laughs> should be in your blood. <laughs> what about the suiciding? Is that uh, even, <laughs> even turn one? <laughs> I'll keep that in mind when we play a community game, Krulza. Turn one, I will attack every Greenpeace. Greenpeace? Turn one. It's in my blood. The attack green, right? <laughs> you stop that now, young man, or I'll come find you. <laughs> All right, all right. We won't attack her. I want to see what orange does. Does is orange actually gonna to try to? Sh oh, okay. Red's gonna break me. Cool. Ah, you know, I didn't want to reach it anyways. Don't make me turn this car around. <laughs> uh, who needs a region? Regions are overrated. Oh yeah, break orange. Orange gets a. Wow, a four on three to break orange? You know, I'm okay with red breaking me because that four on three was uh, actually pretty crazy. Um, had that four on three not worked, and then, so red gave me an eight stack, an eight on one, but he gives orange a four stack on three. Like, I, I feel like uh, he's friend. he likes orange a little bit more than he likes me. It's fine, I played this map yesterday and I won without having a bonus. Yeah, I'm sure we can win a bonus here. If Red is going to be the, the main enemy, then I think we'll be fine. Uh, but we're definitely not going to hold over 12, it seems. But I'm not going to play next to uh, uh, Purple either. Did he name this to Purple? Wow. Just play two stack game and uh, get kills. Sounds like an awesome strat, Curls, though. It would. No, I'll give. Oh, wait, that's uh, that's purple, not red. Do you think we just leave orange alone and uh, let orange and red fight it out? Did pink fight out? Why is it pink haven't taken over this area yet? It's like it's turn, turn four and pink hasn't even taken this yet. I believe in you, yes. Girls, are, are, you, are you just saying that so I. I throw my stacks into um into orange here. All right, Pink. I know this might be a difficult decision, but I think Pink should do this. At least I would do it. No, I'm saying save your stacks and let red and orange fight it out. All right. Yeah, we'll do that. We'll let them fight. We will let them fight. And I don't want to get killed by uh, Royal here, or Purple. I want someone to take that so I can retake this. I want that bonus. Or we could play to this bonus right here. Get a plus two bonus. Take out blue. Blue has 17. Blue has 17. We take out this one stack. We move our, our, our stack right here to this stack. We get a plus two. We take out blue. Blue has four cards. Maybe we take blue out on five cards or three cards. I think uh, red might break pink. 
That's a good question. I didn't uh, think about that. Ah, oh, nah, nah. They, they started a war here. Red versus orange. This is going to be uh, our win condition here. Um, these two fighting each other. The two strongest opponents. Oh, orange doesn't have a set anymore. Orange already turned in. Orange plays board police. <laughs> yes, red is uh, the police here. No one gets a region except for pink. Because pink hasn't had a region yet. So pink gets one. All right, we want to aim to take out blue. I think what we should do is attack into this blue piece. Uh, we path into this piece. Or actually, wait, wait, I take that back. I don't want to take out any of these extra pieces yet. Because if someone else wants to take out blue, I want them to work harder for it. I think we'll move our seven stack closer to the blue piece. We'll go through this blue piece. And we'll group up onto this too to get a plus two. And then we'll uh, loop down. Loop down and take this out. On uh, Blue's um, third card. Because Blue turned in kind of early. Blue turns in early giving us a higher turn. And he's the second one to turn in. Check uh, pink stats for me. Alright. This is pink. Oh, I didn't get that. This is pink right here. And I know you like to see this too, the defeated troops. Thank you, A, hey, no problem. Just making sure pink is an OP. Oh, oh, pink. Pink doesn't like red. These? are crazy these guys are all, all i'm assuming all of these guys are the same rank oh wait a second i wanted uh this one Oh, wait a second. Blue just moved there? Um... Okay. Who's the weakest? Orange? So our big stack is also close to orange, which is nice. We can either go into blue, orange. We can't really go into pink, but pink also has a region, so I don't really want to aim for pink. Well, alright, pink did have a region. I mean, red has been making enemies all game. Red, yeah, I, I think I was red's first. No, wait, I'm sorry. He broke orange first, and then he broke me and orange at the same time. And now he's breaking everyone. Lovely, fight, fight, fight. <laughs> what are these guys doing? Blue will have two cards. Blue will have three cards. We do not have a set, but we could take out blue for the 20 turn in. We take out blue for the 20... Wait, do we even have enough to take... Oh, no, no. We don't have enough to take out blue. Blue has a 24, and I have a 15, so I don't have enough to take out blue. Uh, so we have to take out blue, hoping that we get a set before blue gets a set. And since we go first, I think it's uh, probable... That we get a set before him, but not likely. Oh, actually, I think that is likely. We just need um, another soldier, and usually soldiers have a higher percentage. All right, royals or purple's gonna kill us, so I'm, I'm taking my seven stack out now. Oh, and I, I really kind of want to attack that one now, but um. I don't think anyone, I, I love how all these guys are playing. I don't think any of them are looking at uh, the eliminations. 
So even if I took out this other blue piece, I don't think it would matter, but I still don't want to take it out. I think I'm going to play down here, but I'll attack uh, a couple of, uh, of purple's pieces. You know, purple is going to take over Russia, so I don't think I have to worry too much about my 7 stack being taken out by bots. I think attacked it one now. Alright, we can attack the one now. I don't think anyone will take advantage of it, but it's uh, maybe you're right. I, I could attack it, I think. Unless orange... Uh... Actually, yeah, everyone's on three cards. Now... I think it's likely someone has a set on three, but the person that has a set on three, can they take them out? Right? Red cannot. Orange probably can. Um, who's our next elimination after this? Probably orange. I think we would go for orange after this elimination. I think we take out orange after this. Orange will have four cards, hoping that he doesn't turn it on three. Or maybe, if we're lucky, we can loop around and take out pink after. Uh, because red and pink are keep on fighting each other, so we might be able to take advantage of pink if uh, they don't have a set on three. We do not have a set. We have two horses and two soldiers. Nice. Alright. I cannot take out anyone, officially. RNG, RNG, what is this? This RNG is broken. Hathing? Hathing, you think a 19 can take out 24 with Pathing? If I, oh, what if I went like upwards? I went through the 4, the 1, the 5, the 4. Uh, we go up. We go down, but then I have to go through purple. We go up. Do these touch? Oh man, I don't remember if these touch. I need a way to go from the four to the two, so I can pat this out and come down into this way. I think move your 19 as well, because blue is going to crush it when he trades in. Oh, blue's a bot. You're right, you're right, blue's a bot. Who would crush that? Oh! Purple helping out. I want to see red break purple now. Red's uh, already crippled pink here. I think I actually would have just lost my 19 stack if he turned in there. All right, how am I going to attack on my next turn then? I think we should have my, my 19 stack on here so I can go up into blue. I can go through purple and I can go through red to get to pink. And I think if we play to this, I might actually die. I think we need to put troops on this three stack so that way the bot doesn't take it out. Oh man, I don't want the bot to take this out because I, I think uh, I'll be as easy to take out as blue is. Move it to your one, two spaces away. Yeah. I mean, we can put it there. But I also don't... I think the bot will come down. Just in case the bot comes down, I want to put a stack here just in case we're going to die uh, to the bot on this side of the board. All right, we finally get a set on five cards. Imagine that. No one's even turned in except for reds. Oh, no, wait. I'm sorry. I was the first one to get five cards. Good stuff. I hope it's good stuff. I, I think if I was with uh, good players, I would be eliminated here. Mm -hmm. 
what is Red doing? Oh my gosh, he's actually gonna feed these carbs over to uh, Orange or someone. Yo, Lady Bunrikins, what's up? I'm in VC if you want. All right, Kralza. If I want, do I have a choice? In Yo, what's up? Kralza? If you want, mate. If yeah. you bloody want. <laughs> if I want. <laughs> It's always a choice. You, you've always got a choice. Man, I can't believe what these guys just did to uh, Pink here. So I could harass Sweet Yo play? Yes, obviously. <laughs> but why else would I want to be in voice chat with Yo play? <laughs> yeah, of course. Right. Right. <laughs> let's let's say Blue doesn't turn in. What's your passing gonna be? Um. All right. So I'm gonna go through this one. This one. It will go along the border, the top border of uh, South America. Oh wait, I only got that one. Which, well, which rip, one? rip, never mind. I have to. I actually have to go through uh, orange now to get uh, the pink one. It's in uh, what is this called? North America? Yeah, pink has one in North America. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, it's good that you saw that. Yeah, it's about time I've seen something like that. That's something that always gets me every single time. Uh I, I did that twice. Oh, yesterday. actually, I think I should pass upwards because I can take out uh, orange with his five cards yes. after I take out pink. Yep. So if, you, if you're looking at pink, you go through the two red ones, mm -hmm. and then you go down and around, if that uh, makes sense. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, like go downwards to that 10 stack first. X Davy, why orange and not pink or blue? Oh uh, my gosh, pink actually turned in. There's no way. No, okay. So, now you just chill. Oh, he's taking out orange though. Oh, he's not gonna finish it. Yes, he is. Mm. Oh, maybe. Oh, maybe. Uh, it's, it's, a, it's gonna be close here. Ah, uh, no, there's no way. He's taking way too long for that split. Yeah, he's gonna leave him with like. Three territories, I think. No, I guess very kill for you, you play. Wow, easy. Five cards. <laughs> as long as I don't butcher my path. Okay. Even if I butcher the path. Yeah. Well, don't butcher. Just don't butcher the path. Um. I think we can. Uh, you think? Think about who you're gonna do next. Take out all of reds once we. Think about what you're doing next. Yeah. Think about what you're doing. Why would you hit that for? Oh, I hate your pathing there. Don't Why? forget about the one. Because you could have gone like up and around and then back down to where that link is, back to that one, and then you would have saved more troops to go up the red. Uh, that's true, but uh, since I take out another set here, I was trying to get like, you know, the... I don't know. You know what I mean, though? Um, I'm sorry, what? Like blocked off that little path between um, Asia and North America, like very early on in your pathing. Yes. If you'd left that open, you wouldn't have had to go through that purple eleven. Oh. Yeah, I can see that. Okay, so yeah, I don't know. If Okay, I made another. Oh, just go back around. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Please! Oh my god, you're making so many splits! <laughs> I mean, you get it yet, but you get, you're, you're making so many splits.
No, just add on to the. Th oh my goodness. <laughs> what? <Yeah, fine. laughs> just add, yeah, add three then. Why don't you just add one onto the three instead of putting an extra three trips there? I I didn't see it actually. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Only when you're a girl, so I... <laughs> okay, I'll be honest. I think I've made that move a lot of times. <laughs> Just, uh, I, I like, there's a three sec there and I make it another sec. <laughs> I, I can't count the number of times I've actually done it that way. <laughs> oh, dude, oh, dude you, have, you have so much time. <laughs> You have so much time, dude. Like, you, you literally, once you finish attacking, you still had about 30 seconds on the clock there. <laughs> Did I? Yeah. Alright, this is going to be like, the ultimate test here. <laughs> now, just just take take a moment. Take a moment and think about how you want to pass this. I want to do a box. I'm thinking of a box now. technique from you explaining something to me on that uh las vegas i can't think of a twitch name i absolutely i swear i'm like 50 years older what having watched you play play risk <laughs> like actually <laughs> dude it, it actually it just boggles my mind so much sometimes with these passing <laughs> oh. <laughs> Oh man, that's uh Yeah, you're right. I think uh the more you say that the more I need to keep that in my mind. Just take a second and think. I think I, I just jump right into it <laughs> too fast. Yeah, I think I think you're I think you think you're slower than you actually are. Like You've got plenty of speed, dude. It's it's just about like spending a little bit more time um thinking about the, like the way you want to do it does that make sense um yeah like i don't know what do you do when you're watching your op opponents play are you thinking about how you're gonna move how you're gonna kill people or are you just um, watching them play i i actually just watch them play honestly <laughs> <laughs> oh yes pretty pictures let's go <laughs> i mean uh, like uh, you you were, you were in my chat yesterday like but when you watch me play like i was trying to vocalize it a little bit i'm always thinking about what do i think they're gonna do and how can i do something about it you know what i mean yeah like if you ever watch my mouse when i'm when i'm playing risk if next time you watch me stream what just watch w what my mouse does because you'll just see me just like think about pathing options I want to take. So if you just see my mouse slowly tracing different territories, oh. that's because I'm thinking about do it, is that how I want to path? Okay, so you trace it. That's yeah, I I trace it. Not all the time, obviously, but sometimes if I think it's like really close, or if I'm just like looking at people and thinking, oh, is there a possibility of a kill? I'll just kind of just trace it with my mouse mm. and just think about how does that look you know what i mean yeah no yeah that's uh that's probably that's interesting yeah i think i could try that tracing but then i think uh another big factor is me just thinking for a few seconds on my <laughs> well well i mean i did i didn't want to say anything you play but uh we all, we all know that's a disaster way to happen you think you <laughs> like <laughs> Not even just my pathing. I'm putting two th four stacks right next to each, each other. <laughs> oh my god, dude! Uh, uh, why? <laughs> like you don't need to panic. There's there's no need for you to panic. Like, I, honestly, I don't I ever understand why you panic. <laughs> oh, frustrating your play. You kill me. <laughs> 
I think I need these pet uh, these togs once in a while to uh, remind me of what to do. <laughs> uh, I mean, the thing is, you play like I, I mean, I said this a million times. You have you have so many good fundamentals in this game. You you know what you want to do. You understand how you want to do it, but just like some pos like positioning of you where you where you want your troops and pathing. I think it's just the t the two big things. Yeah. <clears throat> Yeah, I think if I was thinking about my path in earlier, like you said, I, I blocked, I did some routing uh, from Asia, something in Asia. You said you didn't like that path in. No, in North America. Oh, yeah. Where you're killing Orange. Oh, so, uh, can I clip that? And uh, how far back can I clip? I should have clipped it because then I could show you. Well, I'm trying to pull up that Britannia game, but I am trying to set up a, a lobby for it now. No, and I maybe can't, can't we'll have uh, a repay. Um, yeah, but... Uh, this is why I want you to go back and watch your party. Because uh, basically, that kill on Orange, right? That's every single player in your chat would make that play right that's not that's not exactly the the huge play what what the big play is which you ended up doing is training those kills but the thing is you it was in a situation where they had been fighting all game and everyone was on weak troops but imagine if it was really really close mm. like you know saving the extra five to ten troops on pathing mm. could make all the difference in the world right yeah you know, yeah. especially when, when you're thinking about, do you want to take, like, a risky kill? Yeah, no, I can see that. Yeah, I think if that's my scenario. That was, I just got lucky with them fighting, but... No, I mean, at the end of the day, like, you, you did a really good job at killing, and and you know how to do it. Like, yeah. you, you're, you're a good player, you play. Like, I'm not trying to teach you how to suck eggs. No. Because <laughs> you are a, a good player. But I, I just think you could just optimize like a little, a couple of little bits of your gameplay and it will just, it's the difference between winning and losing on like a nice edge, you know what I mean? Yeah. In like a 50-50 game, you can make that like 80-20 game just on pathing and trip placement. Yeah, I definitely need to work on that because I, I, I wasted a lot of troops. Uh, blocked. I blocked in two stacks. Then I blocked in a third stack, I think. But yeah, I mean, but the the reason I said I'd unlock your eight at the start is because you should always just just uh, on habit, just always, always, always have your stacks out in proc proc specifically, not necessarily in fixed. Fixed is a different beast, but um, just like to form the habit, right? Yeah, exactly. You know, you want to you wanna just have good habits all the time. Let me... Yeah, so if you can... Uh, uh, even that game, we can, we can have a look at, like, positioning and stuff. Like, uh... I think there's plenty of games that you play that we can, we can look at positioning, passing, <laughs> and that sort of stuff. I know, all what right. a shock, right? Yeah, well, what a <laughs> shot. <laughs> All right, I think I have it set up. <clears throat> if you're still around after this match, maybe we can do it. I think I yeah, have I should... roughly another hour-ish I can stay. So 30 minutes for this and, I don't know, some time for the other one. Yeah. Oh, well, let's... <clears throat> yeah, let's let's see how you played this one. I don't want to like, you know, coach you in the game as much, but like I just want you like I'm just going to tell you think about pathing, and that's what you're going to hear from me. All right. And you can just you can your chat will just hear my voice get sadder and sadder as I watch. <laughs> as uh, I think of it, I can't think of a Twitch name for this. <laughs> just 
just get older and older. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> All right, we are going fifth. Fifth, okay. The bot goes first. Wow, all of our stacks are at the bottom. We have nothing at the top. Uh, this is not too bad. Do you think, uh, uh... This looks like a very nice spot as well. I, I think white is going to play for the top, it looks like. Um, I don't know if I sh I I don't want to play to one position. I don't think that's a good idea, but I don't know about this three stack either. What's going to happen in here? But I think I have to if I want to uh, survive with two stacks. Oh, well, maybe not. Let's see what pink does. <laughs> you got me. I can't think of a Twitch name. <laughs> Oh my god. Uh, at curler. <laughs> um, last week you were the youngest guy in Pete's waiting on your best behavior. Next time you're on the show, you'll be the oldest. Yes, that's very much true. <laughs> yeah, I can't believe I was the young guy on that on that call. I mean, Olive's younger than me, I think. Um, but yeah, he wasn't in that first game. And I think Nick might be younger than me as well, but he also wasn't in that first game. Oh, oh, you're, I thought you were blue for some reason, your play. I've been completely looking at the wrong troops. Oof. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. Blue, blue yeah. is a nice position, I would say. Yeah. Yeah, I, I really like Blue's position. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I'd have been very happy to have Blue's position here. Oh, Blue's a boss. They put out? Yeah, okay, well, that's good. All right, yeah, I, I really like what you did. <sighs> oh, excuse me. I really like what you did there as well, putting everything on the three to make it the eight. So uh, you got two stacks. Red, oh... <laughs> Wow, I don't want to play next to red, but I'm kind of protected a little bit. Red is making a super stack. He's ready to destroy some big stacks. I think, I think it's a rampaging bot, so I think if you... Stay big, I can stay alive. Stay big, it, it will just... Like, if it's not bigger than you, it will run past you. Cool. So cool. I think you might actually just chuck everything on that eight. Yeah, at left. least my, my eight's kind of protected by this four stack at the moment. Yeah. No, maybe you don't need to check everything on there then, but just check a few on there. And then don't open it up. You play, you silly boy. Ooh, pink wants to go for that region right there, I think. Yeah. Mm. I've decided I don't care. I'll let people have regions in this in this map as well. Yeah, is that uh, work yep. out in the end? Yep. Yeah, it works out in the end. Because it's it's such a small map and there's only four regions. Yeah. Like usually if someone takes over a region, they've condensed the map so much you can kill everyone else. Very easily, you know what I mean? Yeah. Ooh, and I think we might uh, get lucky with another fight here. <clears throat> Looks like uh purple and white might be fighting for the same top. Okay, yep, I like that. I like that oh. a lot. So in my head, what I'm thinking about right now is it, how could I possibly get that pink two down the bottom? To make pink easier, right? <clears throat> no, I'm just that like that's just like what I would be thinking about. I'm just thinking how could I get that pink two like if I was to kill him. You know what I mean? I mean obviously you can't kill him this turn. Like, well, we, we all know you. We can always try, right? You said always think about it. <laughs> yeah, but this is the no. Like, I'm not saying don't like don't think about actually trying to kill someone, but <laughs> think about like the path thing about how, who who's going to come weaker and why. I see. Yeah, yeah, like if I were to take out Pink now, how would I path him? Exactly right. So now that um 
that blue's kind of opened it up, but you have to split to kill pink now. Right. Like, so let's say let's say that ten stack you've got. Let's say that's a thirty stack. Just yeah. for the sake of argument, how would you path this right now? Which way would you go? I think I would drop down to the blue two first to make like a seven split, uh, seven, so I could take the twos on the side, and then whatever's left, I would path it into this uh, the rest of pink, and probably shoot it straight up, straight up the map to get those other two pink pieces at the top. Okay, so I'd do it slightly differently. So what I would do is I'd use my whole stack to go down. Oh. Split and kill that two on the left, and then pass through the two around the ones back into Wales. You oh. know what I mean? That's a good point. I was actually just about to group up my two onto that territory, but if you would path that way, maybe I shouldn't take uh, that territory then. So the what you could do uh, is you could... Um, take that middle one, and then... Oh, I mean, it's up to you. But I wouldn't... I would try not to hit that red one, because that is a nice open spot. You know what I mean? I just wouldn't worry right. about that, too. I'd just... I'd lose it, too, so keep pathing open. So I would add a couple to... Yeah. Like, two to your nine, and then one to your ten, and then use the one on the left to hit that red one, if it was me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. that's what I did. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that, that that's a uh, that's a good point. I didn't uh, like I I have like maybe thought about that, but like I didn't really think about it. Like on turn one, if I were to take him out right now, how would I path it? Yeah, mm. because like if you start thinking about this all the time, it becomes habit, and then as soon as you're ready to kill someone, you just go. You know what I mean? Yeah. So let's say okay. Um. All right, who, who's who's another one? Let's let's say you you get another thirty troops right now. Yeah. How would you pass killing purple? Um, well, actually, no, purple's a very easy kill. Um, <laughs> how would you pass? No, oh, I don't know. They're all kind of easy kills now. All right, let's. Let, how would you pass white? <sighs> I hit the pet white. Trace it with you. Trace it with your mouse so I can see what your thought process is. Alright, so if I was path it white, and are we saying like I have one big stack and one small stack? Because I, I think I would have to you, use... You, you, you're getting 30 troops right now. Oh, okay. I get 30 troops right now. Yeah, I, so you can add it to wherever you want. I think um, I would pat, put it on my 9 stack since there's more ones on that side. Because uh, I think if I use my 12 stack, I have to go through there's some bigger stacks, or at least uh, more troops, I think. So I'd go through the, the least resistance. Oh, wait, it's my turn. Um, yeah, just, no, you uh, do your turn, do you? Yeah, I'll attack these red pieces in here. Ooh, if I were to get 30 stacks right now, I think I would put it on my 9. So maybe I should put my 3 here. I don't know, I'll, I'll put uh, 10 here, put the 12 here, just in case. I'm not really sure if I would take out. Okay, I think I want more troops on that 8, but um, I'd put it on my, my smaller stack right here. I have my 30. I would take it... Um, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 4. I think I would path out right a little bit easier. No, wait. I think I would go through this, uh, these two red pieces, these red pieces, this red piece, and then I get to this eight stack right here, this two stack. Then I go through this three, this, yep. this, this three. Oh my gosh, wait, how do I get to that five stack? Yeah, Purple's in the way. Hmm. Actually, I don't... Yeah, so what you can do, what you can do is when you hit that... When you said you were going to hit that white eight, yeah. you, you split it there. So you oh. split off what you need. You would have need 13 troops to oh, go kill that two up the top, and then you go use the rest to go kill that five. Ah, uh, okay. I didn't see that connection. That's something I, I also don't always see are these connections. Yep. Uh, I didn't know. I thought purple was protecting whites. No, no, he's not. He's trying, well, he's thinking about it, but he's not. <laughs> he's thinking about it. How does that not protect them? They literally don't even touch each other. 
I mean, yeah. But you see, but this is this is why I talk to you about it now because, like, uh, I think let's like if I gave you thirty trips right there, I don't know if you would have been able to kill White. Yeah, no, I don't think I would have. I think or I would've... you would have wasted a bunch of troops. You know what I mean? Yeah, I, I probably would have right to purple to get them because I didn't see that connection. <laughs> But now yeah. that I I seen that trying to pat them out, I wouldn't ideally make that mistake. Exactly. So this is why I'm saying you, this is why I like to think about pathing it out now. I like got it's it. not. There's no point on getting to my turn and going, okay, now I'll. Yeah. I'll we'll start to think about pathing. Like I want to have a reasonable idea of if I want to choose to kill any player on the map, especially now. So we're getting to five card trade-ins now, right? If um, I want to kill anyone, I want to know exactly how I'm going to do it. All right, so spe now, speaking of eliminations, I'm thinking since I go fifth and blue has five cards, I have five cards, I think we should path out blue here because we should get a 12. Right, path out blue? Yeah, because okay, I think... Okay, so you're, you're going to get 12? How are you uh, going to pass it? I think our 14, we go through this eight stack. Okay, wait, this just got my way. We go through this eight stack. There's one. Oh my gosh, go away. <laughs> there's eight stack, there's one. Then there's three. Because if we went to the eight to the three, I'd have to do a split. So we'll go eight, one, three, one. Yes. It, then yes, we'll put uh, the rest here. Go to this one, red one, there's four stack. Then we pat up the reds. And then we take this. Uh... This red so, piece, but I'm gonna have to split on blue. It looks like. You yeah, get so these. what I'd do? You, you've got how many trips? You uh, eleven, twelve, thirteen. So I'd put probably four onto your fourteen. The rest on your ten. Do the passing you said for blue, and then use the ten to kill the rest of them. So go straight down with the ten to that four, and then back up through the red across the other side to kill the other things. Um, all right. Do you understand? Yeah. Yeah, let's see. Let's see, let's see. Wait, I think I, I, heard, I heard you. I was, I'm sorry. <laughs> it was my turn when you were saying that. That's exactly how I'd pass it. Sweet. All right. Now I don't think I could take out anyone, but we should look at who we would take out next. If uh, since everyone's gonna turn in now, I think maybe. Uh, okay, you you don't particularly target bots, but I would target anyone for another turn in. But yeah, anyone. It doesn't matter. It, and, and you target anyone. Yeah. So I would. Mm, yeah, okay, now you gotta put your troops somewhere. But I get five cards on this turn, so I, I could put my big stack here, but I get another turn in to take out another uh, second stack if I want. Or set up another second stack. Yep. Yeah. Wow, red had a set on three. Crazy. Oof. Rest in peace is pink. I, I think know. pink is definitely our... Maybe not our target, but uh, pink just got destroyed. <laughs> okay, so... Path out pink. Let's start pathing out pink. All right, what is pink gets? What what are these oh, turns? Machine. Twenty. No, it doesn't oh. matter. Yeah. Okay. Oh wait. Okay. So pink. All right. So we have our big stack up here, and I don't think we. If we're gonna take out pink, if we want to stay to one big stack, I don't know if it's smart to have one big stack, but uh, we could split At right this here. This point in the game, it's not too bad to have one big stack, as long okay. as you've got open pathing. The reason you want multiple stacks, there's two mm. reasons you want to have multiple stacks one is to make yourself harder to kill mm. and two it gives you a lot more options for killing paths but with the stack sizes getting as big as they are and the way the kind of the board's set up at the moment you've got lots of killing paths and it's very unlikely someone can kill you in one turn I see. so it's not as as bad of an option now to have um one big stack all right um i still think we're taking out pink because we get another turn in all right it's my turn there's a seven i'm gonna put eight here um we turn in i did say i was gonna split right here and then we just path down but then we can leave enough to take out red too once we get this next turn in um, just, think, just think about the, the troops at the top as well 
I... Yeah. Oh my gosh. Gave way too many troops at, at the time. Oh, I don't even get that stack down there. Wow. Okay, well, rip. Yeah, so the, the thing is, you put so many troops up where that your tent is now. You put way too many. So you only needed probably 12 there instead of, I don't know how many you put there, like 16. Yeah, I, I just started scrolling actually. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Wasn't white a better choice? Uh, what did, white has 50. What did pink have actually? I didn't, I didn't look at the numbers. I just seen pink and then I focused on pink. Oh, you're right. If you I tried it, if I take it out, uh, no, I don't. Uh, if I taken out white, maybe you're right. I could have taken him out because white had a, cl a cleaner path to take out. But wait, didn't White have one? No, wait, White has three cards, so he would have had two cards. That's the other thing. I would have immediately, like, fortified my 10 stack out of there, it's obvious that White just wants a bonus. I you know see. what I mean? Yeah, yeah, you're right. Now I think, uh... We don't take a region, because I don't want to be targeted. Then we just, uh... Put her big stack. Right, white has four cards. I mean, I think. Mm, this is a tough game. Yeah. Yeah. Oh because wow. I think nice. Red's nice. gonna just like hit you lots. No. Uh, red's a bot. Yeah, I know, but he's a rampaging bot, so you can't get you know turn in. Um. So he um, just runs in a single, single path. Either way, you got this. Uh, let's go. I don't got this. I don't even have a set on four. That's okay. But uh, that depends just, on what, what he does with his turn in here. Just do not open that 50 to you. Whatever you do, do not open that 50 to you. What's you? Or do we play with fire and open up that 50? <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me. If you do that, I'll come slap you. Here, play. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's see if White thought about his path in this game. I think White thought about taking a reach in this game, actually. <laughs> I don't think. I mean, he is slow, but uh, if he. Not slow enough, though. Yeah. I mean, I think I'm gonna survive, but I don't think I'll survive my next turn with five cards. Yeah. Oh, so there's no way. He's just gonna stop? Okay, he's not gonna stop. Well, fine. Should, I think we should go up through white to make it harder for him, right? I mean, he's already fighting yes. us. Yes, yes. Yeah, if you can get both, uh, both his... Um, bonuses, that's a kind of win. Then he's gonna oh, wow. try and take them back first. Getting a two on one, yeah. That's nice. And you're making pathing harder for him as well. <clears throat> yep. Oh, oh gosh, I thought Red was gonna kill our six. If Red takes out our six, uh, we have no shot at this. We have a small percentage at this now. <laughs> Wow, only attacking my pieces. What I ever do to Red here? Not yeah, even. Yeah, the thing is, like, because it just follows the the singles. The singles. Yeah. Alright, let's see what White's pathing is like. Mmm. Don't use that forty <laughs> stack. No. <laughs> He's going for me. Barras. Oh, he's not sparing us. So that's that's a good example of troop placement. You know what I mean? Yeah. If you, if you do the slightly better troop placement, you win that game.
Yeah, and uh, I, I didn't actually um, really focus on white. I know I can't think of a Twitch name suggested I take out white song. I, I don't know why I was looking at pink for some reason. I seen pink and I, I thought about taking out pink instead of white. But, um, let's see. Let's see if I can share this. I do have this other game up. All right. Bye. All right. This is uh the game that you wanted to talk about, Kralza. Let's see if I can play this. Oh, but you're you're behind a bit. Okay, this is gonna be difficult to talk to you if it's can you about. Share, uh, share screen with me. Yeah, let me see if I can share screen. Uh, how do I share screen with you? On Discord. So on Discord, where it says down the bottom under Voice Connected, it says there's a thing that says share your screen. Gotcha. Share screen. Just click on that, and then I can watch your stream stream live. Right, there we go. Watch the stream. Oh my god, I'm watching two streams now. <laughs> Alright. Alright, um, let's see if I can play this. Speed this up. Oh man, I, oh, I just moving the screen. I need, I just want to go like, skip a few seconds here faster. Yeah, I'll be honest, I don't know, I haven't used this editor in a while. Oh, okay, and it's lagging. Remember that turkey game as well. <laughs> was that a a a, a remember like something I did bad in there? That's why you remember it. Oh, uh, I just yeah. <laughs> uh, I don't think you did anything particularly <laughs> bad in that game. I just hear you talking about me at very quick speed. Oh no! <laughs> oh gosh! Here, let me see. Can I mute this so you can't hear it? Uh, where it is... Kelsey to get out the highlighter. Yes, I wish I could highlight stuff. That would be fantastic. <laughs> All right. I I used to, I used to have a great app that I could like draw stuff on videos, um, for coaching. But I haven't got it anymore. I don't know if it would work for this. All right. If I go here, what is? Uh, let me see what everyone else sees. All right, they can see the video. Then we're fine. Yeah. All right. Uh, okay, I'm trying to play this a little bit faster. I can only go so fast on this. Um, I, I'm guessing you want me to go like a couple of turns ahead right now. I don't know if anything exciting. That you yeah, wanna... we don't need to. We don't need to talk about the start of the game too much. I mean, well, I once mean... again, I think all what you need to remember at the start of the game is um, you should probably stop there. So now, now like the first kind of trade-ins happened. All right. So like everyone has three cards. I just. Some trade-ins when there is four so you want me to go to like the yeah. first trade-in kind of yeah the first trade-in sort of thing because that's this is when you started to get kills yeah how like, do I go? you know it's you can get a oh. kill on your first trade-in but i think often this the second trade-in is really where you want to get kills what's the home button oh my gosh it actually took me back to the beginning of the video oh uh, yeah play. this is oh i, I saw <laughs> when you were still top 500 Oh, did you? For a moment. <laughs> yeah. There was one moment there I saw the top 500, mate. <laughs> I remember. I remember. All right. I, I guess I'll just zoom in closer so I can move it with the cursor instead of with this uh, uh, keys. All right. Lower. Go back to orange. Oh, my gosh. I went back to the last game. Going to be doing this all day. Orange is okay. Orange just turned in. Yeah, yeah. So right. this, this this seems like a fine point to, to to have a look. Okay, so what are we looking at? We we've got we got a ten stack, a seven stack, and a three stack. Yep. So. Oh wait, here you want... Yep. So you tell me, who do you think strong? Who do you think's in a good position, and why? 
Uh, let's see. We got blue looks kind of bad because our second position's bad. Oh, let me start from the top. Green. Green looks like uh, very weak. They have one main position of one stack at the top. So I think green's very weak. Bad position. Orange looks very good. Orange has pieces all over the board. They don't have like a main stack. They have several splits. So they could be better than what they are. But I think they're doing pretty good. Um, charcoal. Charcoal doesn't like have a bad position per se but uh I, with these ones he can be uh set up real easily if these ones were taken out um white i think white isn't i think white's in a bad position given that i think charcoal might take this top region so these uh other white ones who's up here will be taken out but uh, yep. they also have those two stacks at the bottom of the map so they're not like completely out of a second position and then blue has one, basically one position, aside from that three stack right up there that charcoal might take out for the bonus. And then you got me. Um, I have three positions, a seven, a ten, and a three. I think it's possible my three stack uh, might be taken out uh, if someone were to so, just take that out. In my head, that three stack's already dead. I, mm. I, I can't remember what happened that game, but that three stack's dead, so I've just, mm. I don't care about that. It's lost to me. So let's say that seven was a three stack as well. So I would definitely add to that where the seven is now because mm. that gives you so many options. All right, so you can kill blue, you can kill charcoal, you can kill pretty much everyone from those two positions. So I just, you know, give up on it. So you can start playing the video and we can kind of just talk as it goes. Who who do you think is possibly the kill? So you want to try and identify probably two players at this point, knowing that the trade-ins are coming, that you could possibly kill. All right. So what I'm looking for is I want to kill someone when they've got four cards on the second trade-in. All right. If that makes sense. So yeah. you can start playing the video. Let's let it run a bit. Yeah, so at the moment, I'm thinking blue, if blue holds... But blue, uh, yeah, if blue holds, I would think definitely think about blue since I already have all my positions touch him. Um, who else? You say think of a second person. Poss I don't, maybe even green, actually. If charcoal were to take out that green stack up top, well, even if charcoal doesn't take that out, maybe I can even take out green if I reinforce my seven stack uh, with, like, 30 troops or whatever I would get. So, so I what think... I'm looking at now, I yeah. think Green's going to lose his position at the top. Yeah. So he's very weak. So the moment we can see him um, losing that one up the top, even if he doesn't lose that one at the top, it's still quite easy passing because you've got that extra little kick to that top left-hand side where that green one is. So I would be looking at, yes, blue and Here, wait, green. one second, Carl. I need to turn off this music. I can hardly hear you. All right. All right, now. I'm sorry. Yeah, so I'm, at the moment, if I, if I was just dropped into this game right now, mm -hmm. I'd be looking at blue and green, uh, my main two kills, with, um, you know, a possibility of charcoal and a possibility of white. Because you got the 10 to kill the two and the three down the bottom. Mm -hmm. keep, keep, let it keep running. Let it keep running. Mm. I'll just talk as it plays. Um, and then I assume that Charcoal is going to lose his one in Island very soon. Mm. So if I was to try and kill Charcoal, I think actually Charcoal was actually the hardest kill besides Orange on this board at the moment. Yes, because I think you have to split to take out charcoal, right? Like yeah, a couple, absolutely. You have to like that, that that those four ones down there. I don't think you can make a clean path there without split. Uh, yeah. I'm sorry, two splits. You can do it in two splits. You can do it in two splits, but yeah, it's very very difficult. Yeah, you go all through right, the. So blue gets the bonus. So I don't. Oh, okay. He puts all that there. So now I'm a bit more scared of blue because he's put all his troops in one spot. So if, if he was just to, like, defend his territory, I'd be way less scared. But as soon as he starts putting one, tr like, 
one stack, that scares me. All right, I just seen you make a comment. You let blue hold. Were you being serious? Like, should I have broken blue? No. Okay. No, absolutely not. I was joking. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I think I think I even say that in, in like a minute or two. Yeah, I think, I think I say... you you did say that. <laughs> yeah. Um. Yep. So you add to the seven there. Perfect. I really like that. And now, what you want to do is you want to find a nice, easy take that doesn't ruin your pathing. So, yep, okay, that's fine. Okay, yeah, I really like that. So you're moving your 10 stack away from blue. Mm -hmm. That's really good. So you're not threatening him. And you've still kept your 9 into an attacking position. And now you could possibly take all those charcoal ones in one without splitting. Oh, you're right. Yeah. So that's 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 pretty good. Uh, but you will have to split to go up as well. But that's that's a much better position. So for me, I would just be ignoring blue lately. But I just I, he would just wouldn't even factor in my mind anymore. He's just I'm gonna kill him last. Is all I'm thinking about. Right? Wait, you just said you would leave blue out. Like, I'm just not thinking about him. Like, I don't care. Like, he's, he's getting strong. He's just trying to sit there and play his bonus. But, uh, what I'm saying is... Blue has four cards, right? But, uh, yeah. Oh, how big is that bonus? But it's the, only six? Okay. Yeah, it's, it's only, yeah, very small. No, like, but your trade-in's only very small. Right, right. So what yeah. I'm saying is, like, I just, I just would not be bothered about trying to fight him at all. Mm -hmm. I wouldn't think about killing him. I'll just let him let him be. I'll just try and take everyone else out and kill him last. So at the start, we initially were aiming towards like green and blue, right? But now because blue holds something, we can rule out blue and maybe focus a little bit more on green, possibly. Yeah, Is that so? Yeah, exactly right. Okay. So like ev every turn, like every time you. Every time someone takes a turn, you have to reevaluate. Mm -hmm. You know, you can have a plan in your head, but things change very quickly. Mm -hmm. And you have to be prepared to have, like, a second option. And so, what is just throwing the game? <laughs> Wait, did I, so lose, now, did, did I lose this game, actually? No, I think you won this game. Okay. I think you won this game. But the, the reason we wanted to talk about it is because I think, particularly when you go for kills later in this game, yeah. like your pathing is very janky. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. This, this is good. He's, he's moving that. I think that's a three out of your way. I can't tell with the, the cards up. Oh, and you, you, you take him away just as I say it. <laughs> um, so you tell me, what do you, what do you see on the board now? Who do you think is killable? Who do you think's not killable? What are you planning to do? Well, See, I'm even telling you in the chat, you silly sausage. <laughs> <laughs> okay. God, this girls guy really knows his commentating on the game. Yeah. Already. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, so I think now that uh, uh, we were initially ruling out blue because he was holding, but now that he's not holding again, we can maybe include blue. Uh, but I did move my 10 stack away from blue, um, so I don't think we can really include blue anymore. Unless I were to but come you're, you're, around. Your nine stacks there, though. Still. You still have access to him. I so what I would do is I would try and take a nice easy take somewhere and then move my ten stack closer. Okay. Like, I, I think I would aim for that, that two white and then move it. No, way, I'm sorry. White blue has four cards and I don't have a set. So I don't... Well, I, so basically, you, you can still ignore Blue here. Yeah. Um, because he's going to get a trade in before you. Unless you t kill him this turn, like mm. there's no point thinking about it. Mm. Okay, so I, I don't like where you move that five. So you see how you move that five? You've, you've um, blocked access into... Uh, uh, I, I think I did that and I said in the video island. because I was trying to block someone from taking out white because white has 15 that that was the intent of that blocking yeah but he also only has one card 
Like, what's the point of blocking someone for one card? I want someone to try and kill him. For oh, one you're card. right. One card. You know what I mean? Right, right. So why would you like if if he had f like four five cards? Yeah, okay, I I get that play a little bit more. Mm. But he's only got one card. We know that um, Green wants Island. Like, it's painfully obvious oh. that he wants Island. Yeah. Dude, what's he doing? Okay, well, Charcoal's just gonna hit that. <laughs> All right, Green. <laughs> So, it's such a weird game. Right, I can't see who's at the very top. I assume it's Charcoal in that island to the very top of the map. Yeah, I think he took that a while ago. Yeah, okay. So, you've got five cards. Mm -hmm. So, I should think about it. So we should think about is there is there a kill somewhere? All right. So because I still don't think is... orange is not green. No, not green. What does green have? Three cards. So I should aim for three people cards. that have three plus cards, ideally. So definitely not white. Yeah. Because you're gonna trade in, right? So you're gonna yeah. get fifteen. Mm -hmm. So right so... now, the weakest is orange. Okay, I'm sorry. Or I mean, in terms of truth counts, but not in position. Well, no, Charcoal takes out that position. Uh, would I still take out Orange? I do a split, right? I had to do a split to take out that three stack at the bottom. Okay, so this is how I would path it out if I was doing Orange. I would put uh, six troops on this one to make a seven stack to take out the three. Yep. Um, I would put, what is this, four, six, seven, eight. I think I'd put like maybe 12, 13, like a total, like uh, a 13 stack on that bottom stack. And then maybe put the rest uh, on this top portion to take out the rest of orange. Yeah, okay. So basically, you need, so you need to put six there. That's too many. You, you don't have enough troops. Or you, if you do, it's very risky. So you take out I orange. Would just, uh, yeah, I would. What I would do is I would just set up to take out orange next turn. Okay. So I would add. But the turn ends twenty. The turn ends twenty. Uh, what a blue just got fifteen. Oh, why is it twenty? Why is it so early? Uh, that's a good question. Why did blue just get fifteen? I just seen it said blue got fifteen. Wait, no, no, there's. Oh. No way it could be 15 or 20. We'll, we'll find out on your turn. Uh -huh. But if it's 20, yeah, you probably can. Mm -hmm. But you need... So basically count the number of troops you, you're going to hit mm -hmm. and then add like five, four or five to it on like a short little run like this. And that should, you should be pretty safe with that. Oh... The oh, other it, option is white I, is very, very weak. And you might go for him right here. So what did I just... I so didn't, this is fine. This is... Oof. Yeah. Okay, I think you might not have liked that pathing, right? Was that bad pathing? Oh, wait, I took out white here. Okay. Yep. Oh, I took out white for the one card. Did white have one card? No, he had two cards. All right. So this way... So this... I don't mind this because you basically... You're, you're, you're setting up ready for next turn. So mm. now, what I would be doing is I'd be moving that 26 to... Okay. I would have moved that one to the left on that bigger territory. Okay. It does the exact same thing, but you've also got the option of going after blue. Right. Okay, because blue had three cards too. Yeah. I mean, it's not too bad. Like, it's, it's hidden out the way, so you don't threaten blue. So... Mm. It's not too bad, and you've just got to go through like an extra one or two. But it is something um, to consider to be optimal if it was like closer. Yeah. If it was uh, closer, yeah. Gotcha. So now, look, uh, what I'm looking at right now is green. Like, I know for sure that Charcoal is going to hit all those ones green. Mm. Like, 100%. 
So I'm thinking I want to put everything on my nine and take green out next turn. Or you could put... No, you can't. You can't put everything on your 26. Oh, you could. And then go up through the blue three to the one. Okay, let's say Chuckle didn't take out all those ones up there. Would you have packed the 27 first and then taken the ones straight up through where Chuckle was at? Or, um... So he... let's say... Okay, well, Chuckle got him. So mm. that's... You could play by Chuckle. Actually, no, it's not. Why, why did he do that? He doesn't get a trade in. He trades yeah, in three. <laughs> okay. Now kill Charcoal then. Yeah. All right. So, what I would be doing is I would put how many troops you're going to get? You're going to get 35? 30? Uh, not sure. Yeah, probably 30, 35. Okay, so what I would do is I'd put everything on the 9 and then hit the 11 first and then go around to the right. Mm. And so you, you're leaving those charcoal ones that if you needed to, you could use your 26 to come back and get. Okay, so now you put everything on there and what I think you do is I think you block your self... Oh, and you fucked it. No, I, it still comes out, oh, no, right? you go for blue. Oh, no, you go for blue. Okay. Blue had four cards. Yeah. I think... Um, you must uh Can you just rewind, like... Yeah, yeah, sure. Like, a minute? I just want to see how many troops he had. Uh, okay, yeah. Play it from here. Like his blue's turn. Yeah, 40 ish. 41. 40 ish. Yeah, so. Right, let me just watch how you path this again. So, how would you path blue? Alright, so we know you're going to go kill blue. So, yep. what's the pathing? Um, well, I think now if I were to path this out in my head, I. Uh, I would path up through the orange pieces. No, wait. Yes, no. I like... Yeah, oh, wait. Actually... Okay, I... Okay, I, I was thinking about doing it that way, but I didn't know if I could do it better so I don't get these two charcoal splits. Is is there a way to do that yeah, so you don't so get it, two yeah, splits? Pause it, pause it. Pause okay. it. Yep. So, instead of... So, I would have gone through... The, I would have used the nine to take out those charcoal pieces, mm. and I would have gone through the orange ten. Because oh. if you go that way, it's one clean path through blue, and then you finish with your stack ready to take out charcoal. Yes. Okay. And now I see. Yeah, you're saying okay. So we go through that, and then after we take out blue and get the turn, and we can path out orange after. Or, uh, or or charcoal. Yeah, you're right. Either Char one. Yeah. Because you will finish. We see where your 17 is right now. Yeah. If you pass going down first, you will finish with all your troops where that 17 is. And you would have used your nine to take out those three charcoal pieces in the middle of the board. Um. Okay, so what do I have right here? I have then like... you wouldn't have to split. Right. I have like about 33, 34 troops right here. Can I done this if i pat through orange like did i have enough troops to go through orange yeah, so go go back you had like 69 troops oh my gosh like oh i went too far oh so, yeah yeah i have a but, 60 stacks yeah oh. so let's let's say i think you had more than 60 to start with but let's say you had 60 okay so you hit 10 14 15 20 21 22 23 24 25 um 50 53 yeah 100 100 percent you get that okay does that make sense no yeah it makes sense but i'm trying to see so i just attacked him and i i take blue's big stack and i end it with 33 okay and 33 is probably yeah you're right 33 could take out the rest of this side of the board if i went the other way because this is yeah this isn't much on this side now yeah yeah 15 orange and then like six blue 
Yeah, so I counted all the troops in your way, and that was 53, and you had 60, let's say 65. Mm -hmm. So you're, you're plus 12. There's no way you're losing an extra 12 troops on the way that balance blitz works. Yeah. And you see, you see how you've created all these extra splits for yourself. Mm -hmm. So you see where your 17 is? That could potentially be like a 25. Plus, you don't have to do any splits or anything against charcoal. And you've missed that one charcoal piece as well. Yeah, I, did. I didn't, I didn't pat them out beforehand. Yeah. Okay, so, what about that split I just did? I dropped a three off on the side. Is that fine? No. Okay, Wait. pause it. Go back. Okay, let me. Because you could, you can, you can go down the other way. You know what I mean? Okay. So well... if you'd gone. Um, okay, so I'm right here. You still would have gone right this. here, right? Is this... Uh, this is still the biz... Uh... Should I path it upwards differently? Or like... so, 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 if you go back, like, another, like, 10 seconds. Uh, let's see if I can go 10 seconds. Oh, it went way back. Alright, so, like, right... Yeah, like, yeah, no, you had it, you had it, you had it. Like right here. Yeah, yeah, right, right there. That's fine. Okay. Mm -hmm. So let's let's assume that you use that nine to 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 take out those other two ones. I'm just gonna ignore those other two ones okay. right now. Mm -hmm. So what I would do is I would in this position I'd hit the seven. Mm -hmm. I would hit the one above the seven. Then mm -hmm. I would go left one, up one. Uh, uh, then what? I'll, then I would go right up to the top. So let let me let me just. Uh, I wish I could draw on this. So I would go <laughs> seven. Yeah. Up one. Yeah. Left one. Up one. Right one. Up one. Up one. Then I would go. So that's a split. Oh, you, you, have, you have to split once. Yeah, so that's what I did. I did split uh, once. Yeah. But you you technically would have did it differently than what I did it. Oh, I would have done it slightly differently. But I think in either scenario, we both split, but... Um, let's, let's see. Oh, wait, wait. Did, oh, I feel I like... I think you split twice, though. Yeah, you're you right. more than once. No, no, no. No, I didn't. I split once. Okay. But I do split twice here. I don't know if that's... Yeah. I mean... I don't think you need to split there, because you can just go through the nine, because you've got so many troops. Mm -hmm. You just go through the nine. Even though you know or uh, Charcoal has five cards, like, make orange Yeah, but you would have killed him. Like, I know you, you... But at this point, when you did this, you didn't realize you hadn't killed him. Like, when you were hitting him, you thought you were killing him. I gotcha. Right, right. So instead of splitting there, I would have gone where your 22 is now. So when you hit that one next to your 22 on the left, mm -hmm. I would have gone down through the orange nine into the other one. Oh, okay. If that makes, because then you don't have to split and you've already started getting orange weaker because you've got so many troops. Yeah. Right, yeah, because I... I would have technically been taking them out right after, so... Exactly. I, yeah, I should have... It's just, just like... It's just the small... Um... Optimizations, you know what I mean? Yeah. Um... Is he gonna hit your 22 stack? No, because he's an idiot. <laughs> Okay, so I think I think this is the point where I actually get upset about you. But I think is it... yeah. So you see where you where you, you had your five. If you went up to the left, like yeah. why not go up to the left and go that way? Right, and I think uh, just to the on the street, I say I didn't see that connection. I didn't even know that connection was there. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, would I have still would I have done it differently if I known that connection? I don't. No. Yeah, for sure. No, I don't think Black's winning this game, <laughs> Zach. 
<laughs> Bar wins. <laughs> wins on three cars. <laughs> I mean, not even Yoplay can throw this game from this position. I have 42. I mean, do, you, do you understand what I mean, though? Like, I, I remember being more upset about this game. Maybe it was a different <laughs> one that I was more upset about. Probably like 90% of my games, right? Yeah. Oh my gosh, he actually had a set and he has more troops than me. And oh, he's fast. I... Did I really lose this? There's no way. I thought no. I won. No, I don't think he lost this. Yeah, see, I like this pathing by him. This is good pathing. Oh, okay, okay. You're not just uh, saying that because is... he's charcoal, right? <laughs> no, I mean, I don't play charcoal. Uh, what did this... So, oh. so what I would have what I would have done there differently, instead of attacking that big territory, I would have hit that one, but, like, where you're left. Mm -hmm. I would have hit that, I would have gone into Wales first, and then gone around the bottom. And then come back up that way. Like going through Orange's four stack? Yeah, why not? Yeah, that, no, I was, yeah, I was just saying. I think that, that would have been a nice path because you, you clean the bottom off, right? And you don't have to split like exactly. five times. Yeah. And I think See, he had like, the, the hey, troops he, for he, it. He, I think he might have been able to kill you if he passed that correctly. Yeah. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. This is this is this is what I'm saying. Like it's so important that if you if it's fifty fifty like this, if you path correctly, um, you just win the game. Okay, you go for the oh, kill on orange here. Okay, so that split so, might have cost me, right? Like I could have done that better, maybe. Yeah. So why did you split there? Why don't you just go, like, if you rewind a second? Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, I think this is this is actually where I get upset. I think this is when I was watching <laughs> you going, what are these splits and stuff? Yeah, it probably was. All right, let me. Okay, so let's let's let, let's go let's let's go back. The so rate of this thirty three. I I feel a little so iffy about this part. Yeah. Okay. So, um, I think I would have attacked that one right above the thirty three actually. <laughs> Can can we can we roll back a little bit more to wh where you placed all your troops? Yeah, sure. Okay. All right. So fifty nine there. All right. So we got we got 50, 50, 59 mm -hmm. troops. Um. So what would be the optimal pathing for this? I would have instead of putting all my troops there, I would have thought about putting them down where the one is at the mm -hmm. bottom. Because if I go that way, I can go up through the 10, through that big territory one. Ooh. Because um, how many has he got? 43, 41. And you got 60? You got 60 troops total. Right. And so, Orange had 40, right? What do you have? He had 50? Ooh, he had 50. So I wouldn't go through the 13 okay, maybe, stack, yeah, right? Okay, yeah, okay, maybe it's not too bad. I'm just trying to like look at optimal pathing though. Right. right. So let's okay. So when when you did this though, mm -hmm. uh, you could have gone seven, four, six, one, one, three, five, six. I think I did right. Yep. I did. No? Yeah, I just did that. Is it? Yeah, do you want me to replay? I just yeah, did. Okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah, okay, yeah, you did, you did. <laughs> All right, good. Uh, and okay, so now here, how many troops you got? You got thirty? No, 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 that's fine. Go back to where we just were. Oh, okay, let me. Get so you just as soon as you've killed that six, pause it. Okay. Yep. So that's fine. So now, you kind of went to the right, I think. So yes. why not go down through the five? So you go five one one. Ooh. Hit the four. Hit the one, then hit the ten. Okay, right. So, and... so, so, so let's say you do that. So, how many troops is that? So, you're gonna hit, so you've got 35, 5, 6, 7, 11, uh, let's say 15 mm -hmm. plus 10. So, that you would have probably 12 to 15 on where that orange 10 is. If you path that way, you have 12 to 15 troops there. Okay. You know what I mean? Yeah. And then you've got, you can then path to the right and clean up 
Chaco going that way. Yeah, like going up, upwards, kind of like, or taking the center p column first. Kind of. Yeah, exactly. Oh. Yeah. And then. So, but let's have a look how you you did your passing. Oof, let's not <laughs> going straight down. Oh yeah, I did the exact opposite. I go to the ten first. Yeah. So now, now you've locked ten troops away. Yep, and I think I made like three, four splits right here, and I'm locked exactly. in. Oh yeah. gosh, yeah, I'm you locked. Know what I mean? Yeah. So you've you've basically you've got what twenty available troops to a hit, and you've you've reduced that to ten. Mm -hmm. And so only one side. I think there's three splits, and I can only hit one one section of this. Exactly. Oh my gosh. It, just, it makes it so much more difficult. All right, let's continue playing. So, okay, now now we're in a bad position. What do you think? Where where do you want to put your troops? So, pause it. Tell me where you're going to put your troops before you put, place them. Um, so, where well, do you think? How would you do this now? I think this 10, 1, 2, 3, 4. I think this 10. Actually, I might need a little bit. So, I want to use this 10 to take out the right this right chunk. Um, I think I need a little bit more on the 10 because I have to split right here. Uh, to take out yep. that three and that one and then um i think i would put a stack next to the 13 to hit the bigger stack first um so i do like i don't know 20 ish or maybe more than 20 maybe 21 to take out the 13 oh wait that can also touch the three so we'll do 13 18 uh 21 22 so maybe like 26 a 26 stack uh might be a bit much maybe 25-ish or somewhere in that range and then put the rest above that three stack to take the top section uh that yeah so what i would do mm -hmm. is in where island is like the one of those top ones at island i would put what's that one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve so i'd put about 20 there and then i'd put dump everything else on that 10. So then what I would do is I would uh, go up, hit that three, leave 12 troops there, hit that one to the right of the three, hit up and down, then use my 10 to take out the one, five, three, and 13, and then use the 20 up the top to clean up Scotland. Um. Okay, wait, did you, you said you would play to the, the position above the 10, right? Is that what you said? So, so where your 10 is, I would dump 40 troops there and 21, 22, where, Ooh. like, something Wait, else, what, like, this 40's blocked in. What does the 40 do? The 40 takes out the... So, if you go to Ireland, on the top left-hand corner of Ireland, mm -hmm. I would put 22 troops there. And I'd use that to take all of Scotland out. Oh, okay, so the Scotland's the top part. I, I don't know what the sections are called, honestly. Okay, yeah, it's, well, I mean, it's the UK. So Scotland's that top part of the map. Gotcha, okay. Yeah, so I would I would put 20 troops in Ireland mm -hmm. to, to kill all that. So I would go, uh, I wish you could, you can't see my mouse, but <laughs> I, I would go 20 troops to take all of Scotland, mm -hmm. and then I'd tr dump all the rest of my troops onto that 10, because that 10 can hit the rest of them right okay so then i only have to do uh how many splits do i have to do total four splits total two so if i use the the 10 so yeah. i hit the three i leave 12 13 troops there mm -hmm. i hit the one i have to split up once to get that one mm -hmm. and then i can take the other two territories then i can use the i don't know what's it going to be 35 whatever's left i'm going to go left to hit the one hit the five split to the 13 split to the three mm. and then i would back myself to path scotland all in one go okay i think you would have to yeah no you don't you don't have to split to um kill scotland uh yeah you no would... i i did do scotland right i we passed it out and you had to do one split no you don't not not with the way the troops are at the moment Oh, okay. I see. You can okay, kind of go. Say, you you, you, go you can see a path. Yeah, go to there like. There is a path there. Left to the right, and then end, yes, at, so end at that top left part. 
you know how that that little jutting out place is yeah. like still Ireland, not Scotland. Yeah. On on the bonus, yeah. If you if you if you hit there first and then go up to that left hand side, through to the top island and then down and just jigsaw it down, you can hit all of that in one go without having to split. Okay. I w dude, I wish there was a way to like set up these situations. I know that would be <laughs> awesome. Why don't they have that? That'd be great for practicing. Yeah, exactly. You could just set up situations to have a look at them and then see if you can actually path them out. All right. Let, uh, let's, let's see so what let's I just... hear. Yeah. Uh, so, yeah. So you, you did exactly what you said you were going to do. Yep. You put 23 and you've, you've made three different splits. Mm -hmm. I don't think you're going to kill him this turn. Yep. And then I also would have hit the three first rather than the one. Oh yeah, I kill him. Oh uh, yeah. Oh, that. You see how many extra splits you're having to do? Oh, so I would have done my. four splits total. Okay, even there, I didn't see that connection. That's why I split that three off. I didn't know that connection <laughs> goes right off. <laughs> All right, now I know there's a connection right there, but yeah, no. <sighs> Yeah, I think that would help if I if I looked at that for a second. For sure. Yeah, I think I think the the biggest thing for you, yo play is you have to just sit there and and look for it. At, at, like you know, spend ten fifteen seconds looking at it. Hmm. Well, well, maybe not fifteen seconds, but spend like four or five seconds just having a quick look. Oh, look at him! Four hundred and twenty-eight. Wow! Imagine look that. At, was... Look at. Look at you, boy. That was, it feels like yesterday almost. <laughs> I was 400 yesterday, now I'm like 2k today. <laughs> oh no, yo play. Oh no. Oh my gosh. <laughs> but th th does that help at all? Do you uh, know what I mean? No, yeah, I think uh, it definitely helps. And I think it definitely helps to... Um, uh, Cat out players from turn one, like I, I think I, that kind of actually helped a lot. I uh, no, I'm not actually two k now. I, I, I was joking. I'm, I'm one k, right? What, what am I? Oh, I'm one point three k. I think you're like thirteen hundred something like that. Yeah, yeah, where's my screen? Oh yeah, you guys can't. See. Let me uh. Yeah, there I am, thirteen hundred. I was dabbling in the wrong game settings, and I won't do that mistake again. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, he tri tripled his rank. Look at you, you tripled your rank, mate. I tripled just it. The, just, just in the wrong direction. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, is, is it, you want to go lower? I thought uh, higher is better. Isn't that how chess works? Higher the number, the better? <laughs> no, maybe. I don't know. <laughs> All right. But yeah, I, I think, fun fact, yeah, play has 100% win rate on prog caps this season. Well, has he played one game? <laughs> one game. <laughs> All um, right, uh, Carlos. I don't mean to cut you off so short, but I really have to go to a, a meeting in five minutes. Uh, so I do have to uh, end the stream here. But um, uh, no worries. I really appreciate you helping me here. Maybe I'll I'll consider that taking out people from turn one. Uh, th like that thought. Because there are some plays I would have done in that the game I played today. But when you mentioned it, I didn't want to hit a certain territory, so I didn't have to path awkwardly then. Yeah, so that's the thing. It's about like making sure right from turn one that you keep your attacking lanes open all the time. Mm. Yeah, it's 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 so much about just keeping your attacking lanes open and just understanding who's getting weaker and why are they getting weaker. Mm. All right, go to your meeting. All right, thank you. All right, see you guys. Uh, see you, Carlsa. Thank you for stopping by. Um, all right, guys, we will be ending the stream here. I will be streaming again tomorrow. I think I should be streaming tomorrow. Later, CG. Later, I can't think of a Twitch name. Um, before we go, we will raise someone. Good luck in your meeting. Thank you, Zachary. Oh, wait, and thank you, Zachary, for the raid. Much appreciated. All right, who is on uh, that we can quickly raid here? 
Uh, we got Spud. Spud's on. I guess we can raid Spud here. All right, peace out. Thank <laughs> you.